Kola. Mm. The Kola is okay. Yes, gentlemen, we want to know your name and the reason why you're here. My name is Dem Gasta Opondo. I'm of 31 years of age. I'm born in Uganda from Tororo district in Molanda. I'm brother to government spokesperson, the so-called Ofono Opondo, the misinformer of the government. I'm here to denounce NRM. I've never been with them. In fact, uh, I've never stayed with NRM. I've never been. I'm part of people power and I'm strongly part of people power. And it's not only now. I started a long time. You can follow me on my social media. It's about two, three, four years that I've been following Bobby Wine every single day. And when he announced this, that is people power, I'm already part of people power. Thank you, gentlemen. Uh, my last question to you. Don't you feel scared being part of the people power, yet your brother is the government spokesman? I have never eaten my brother's money, and I'm not wishing to eat that money in any way. I've been brought up by my own. I started my life in the young age. I left Uganda in 2000. I went to South Africa. I stayed there like a ghetto boy. I've come back here. I'm still living like a ghetto boy. So I don't care about what he can feel or what he says because it's none of my business what he's doing. But I'm asking him to change, also be part of people power. If a phone of Pondo can see hundreds and thousands and millions of Uganda, the way they are crying everywhere, but for him he's caring about his own stomach. I know one reason why Ofono cannot leave Museven, because of what he did. He thinks when he leaves Museven, Museven will take him in jail. The murder he did in 2004 in Kamp or Kampala Parent, where he shot someone. Now, when, whenever he thinks like leaving that man, they're going to put him in jail. So he has to insist on being. But I know he's a man that is pressed. He's very, very pressed. He does not even know what to speak. Do you have any political ambitions in your future? My political ambitions, I, I want to stand as a MP in 2021 when it comes. I want to remove Honorable Oboto both because he removed the age limit. He was head of the legal and is still head of the legal in the parliament. I'm standing against him. Tell us your name once again. My name is Dem Gasta Opondo. I'm coming from West Ipodama South. The same constituency where uh, both of both comes from, Opondo Opondo comes from. Uh, the IGP, Okoth Manti Noshola, in fact, is my, is my nephew. And most of this, the Tango Doys are coming all from the same, the, the, the same constituency. But they cannot see the poverty of people in Tororo. Tororo place and the whole eastern they have removed each and everything which is there because first of all we had Uganda Revenue Authority was, was based in in, 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 in Malaba. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uganda Revenue Authority was in Malaba. It used to employ a lot of youths from that side but now it's returned back to the central area. So youths there they're very poor. All the factories have also been removed from there. Uganda still it has been turned back here, it's roofing. Tororo cement is only Indians who are there. People who are working within there, they're all poor. There are a lot I can say, but for now, let me keep it that way. Thank you, sir. All right.